Hi guys, Bailey from Create Your Future here. I am a certified Law of Assumption coach and I am here to help you awaken your inner euphoria in order to get everything that you want. We still have our super fun contest still going on and the details are in the description box below. Be sure to check it out. And as always, if you guys want any help with one-on-one -on -one coaching with me, feel free to sign up and we'll work towards getting you your manifestation. So today, guys, I'm going to talk about why you don't have to do anything at all to get your manifestation, okay? Because a lot of times people feel like they're not doing enough to get their manifestations and what they don't understand when us coaches say it's effortless, it's because it genuinely is. You know, when you think about it, you're already manifesting everything, even right now. So what I would like for you guys to do right now is just to get super honest with yourself, okay? No judgment. Do not judge yourself. But what I want you to do is just kind of ask yourself if you've genuinely been on top of your mental diet, if you've been persisting with all of your affirmations, and if you have not been reacting to the 3D. So if you were able to agree and say, yes, I've been doing all of those things, then you can honestly see how easy this truly is. And you're probably experiencing already having your desires. Because what you're doing is you're not changing anything about yourself except for your thought process. You're not even taking any action in the 3D and you can attest to that because there's genuinely nothing else that you need to be doing. So I wanna go ahead and share a quote with you guys from Neville. And Neville says, if I could take you with me and persuade you to believe that you are already the one that you want to be and that you could really believe that you really are, and remain loyal to such an assumption that you really are the man or the woman that you want to be, I know from experience that you would become it. Okay, so the thing with what he just said and where a lot of people end up going wrong is you have to be so consistent with yourself in order to get these results. Because guys, I'm going to tell you right now, you're getting whatever it is you want. There's no question about that. You know, that factor is 100% guaranteed. Whatever it is you want, you're going to get it because you said so. We honestly just get so lost in the 3D that we start to allow it to control us and we forget that we're always creating. We are so busy questioning everything that we don't even allow anything to come through. You know, there's a common question that I'm always asked, whether it's, you know, clients or even just comments in um you know underneath my videos and things like that it's you know how could i ignore the 3d it's so hard but you have to remember it's only hard because we tell ourselves that that's the case the only action you can take to ignore something is to give attention to something else and you can honestly practice this guys just by telling yourself you know there's genuinely nothing for me to worry about there's absolutely nothing for me to doubt and there's honestly nothing to fear because everything always works out for me. And you're going to start to notice that the worry and anxiety begins to turn into such a sense of calmness for you guys and you're going to always know that you ended up shifting into your desired state because the thing is though the calm brings a sense of alarm with it in a way because it starts to make us question whether we're doing enough. But what you have to remind yourself is it's done. There's nothing more for you to do and you just need to allow things to start to flow. It's really just that simple. And the more that you guys practice this, the easier it's going to get. Because I want you guys to remember this is just like a learning process, okay? So think about the process of learning to ride a bike or even speaking a different language. Because you're understanding how to do something for the very first time and you know by experience, the more you do something, the easier it's going to get, okay? Because really, in order to manifest anything, your mental diet is going to be the most important action that you're even taking. It's not just a quick, easy fix. It's going to be something that becomes a part of your lifestyle, okay? So even think of a mental diet like learning a new yoga move, because if you practice this move every couple of months, sure, 
you'll have the skill down by the end of the year, maybe. But if you practice this every single day, even if it's for 10 minutes a day, that consistency is going to become something easier and easier and you'll be able to hold that position for longer increments of time, you know, or you're going to have it down with ease and then you're going to get excited about it and you're going to notice your improvements and each time you're practicing it, you're getting progress. So it becomes something really simple and something really fun for you. Okay, because really the term mental diet gets overcomplicated for, you know, various of reasons, but I just want to break down what it is we actually are doing when we say that, you know, you are simply only controlling your thoughts. You're stopping them from going into a negative direction. And honestly, the more frequently you do this, the better you get at just stop stopping them, you know, dead in their tracks. And then you're just going to notice the internal shift you have of feeling better overall. Because when you start to think positively, your inner world shifts and hence your outer world, it just has to follow with that. You know, that's the law and that's how it works. But really, that's just the beauty of all of this is you can decide right now to put an end to those negative thoughts and change your current circumstances right in this moment. Because you'll find yourself truly getting excited about manifesting and what it is you want to see in your reality as the creator. The only thing that genuinely matters is the beliefs that you still hold about yourself in regards to manifesting, you know? So if you believe spending an excess amount of time at the gym is what will ultimately help you shed off that extra weight in the quickest way, then that's what's going to work for you because you just set that rule up for yourself, you know? And it's the same rules you set with money, right? If I work X amount of hours, then I'll have this amount of money. Or if I pick up these extra shifts, then maybe I'll get recognized and I'm going to get the raise that I want. Okay, and the only reason we take action in the 3D and we see results or we see evidence of it working is because that's the belief system that you just set up for yourself and it has to play out. So even think of it, you know, in the opposite ways. If you want to eat ice cream every single day and still get the body of your dreams, then you can because it's all up to you to just persist in it and then end up receiving it effortlessly. Okay, because you don't have to force yourself to do anything or take any type of action at all. You simply stop seeing yourself as separate from what it is that you want and you just step into knowing it's already here because you have to understand you are truly the creator of your reality. And I know so many of you say, yeah, 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 I understand that. But the thing is you don't because if you did, then you would understand why when you say your SP is going to text you, they do. Why when you say, I want to get a raise and you get one, or when you even say something as simple as I'm going to be slim thick without the gym, you just have that body because it's just as simple as because you said so. Okay. So stop the limiting beliefs and really allow your belief system to work in the exact way you want the world to work for you. Okay. Make your rules and allow the lifestyle you desire effortlessly. So I want you guys to just affirm with me. I get everything I want because I said so. I say something once and it's mine because I am powerful. I am shown every single day that I am the creator of my reality. Okay, so I intend that all of these affirmations work for you guys instantly. And if you found this video helpful, feel free to like and comment down below. As always, if you guys want any helps uncovering your blocks or getting your manifestations, feel free to book with me. Keep focusing on what it is you do want. And remember, guys, give yourself grace and be grateful for the journey that you're on. I intend this video helps anyone um, feeling stuck or feeling like they just feel like they're not doing enough at all, you know, and enjoy your manifestations that you're pulling in every single day, big or small. Goodbye, love bugs, and I'll see you next time.